Hi, Jill here, and I have a haul video to show you. I um, got a chance to get out of the house yesterday. I was feeling pretty good, and my surgery went great, like way better than I expected. So I actually did some shopping yesterday, which was really cool. I went to my local scrapbook store. I also went to Michael's, and at my local scrapbook store they had, what are you called? Well, of course, my mind's eye. I've been loving their stamps because it's six dollars for a stamp set and it matches their paper collections which just you know makes it really easy but this is the holly jolly set i really like the trim and the ornaments and of course the snowflakes and then this big word so i'll be using that they also have gotten in a whole bunch of new scrapbook papers and this is a store they're located in orlando florida called pigtails and they do classes and they have a really nice teacher there and someday I'm gonna find the time to take a class with her just you know to relax and spend some time just doing something for me this is creative imaginations not familiar with it but I wanted a music print for my reindeer so I could be like Tim Holtz and also my rosettes I thought would look really cool and so it's white with gold thought that was really pretty they got in Graphic 45, Christmas Past Collection, and it came in and went. <laughs> Big shocker there. But I'm okay, because I had gotten some. But this I got from them. I think they had three sheets. And then this big guy. He's cool. Yep, and then the one with these, which I didn't have. And they all have names, but then we've got some Bow Bunny. And tell me, doesn't that's just the same look in, in the green and red? I really like that. I might go pick up a, another sheet of this one. Really, really like this. And then look at the back. I don't know which page to use, so that's why I might go back and get some more. And then these I thought would make some really nice labels. And again, a beautiful back. Okay, so that's what I got there. I was good. <laughs> Maybe because I already had some Graphic 45 paper. So I placed an order with two pieces in a bucket. Super fast service, and I got free shipping over $50, so that made me happy. So I got the 8x8 stacks of Steampunk. I'm not going to go through them. You guys have seen them. I fi finally got my Halloween in Wonderland. It's a nice glare. And the Christmas Pass. And this is a deluxe edition. It's got 14 sheet, 14 patterns to each as opposed to 10 patterns to each. So that's why this one was a little bit more expensive. And then here, here's that same piece of paper again. I had bought that seeing that I could use it. Oh, hold on. You have to fall in. Okay. I'm not going to let that paper sit on the floor. So I bought another sheet of this. I got the frames. I love, again... The Vintage Santa. And then I got the tags. And then I already opened this. But I got the My Mind's Eye. I had such a good time with the Haunted set. So I knew I'd want something My Mind's Eye. Obviously I got the stamps. And actually after the fact. So I picked up the paper pack for the Holly Jolly. And... There's the little die cuts. I just see a lot of uses for this paper. Beautiful colors, more sophisticated, I think. I like this one, it's almost into a bluish tone. Of course, the reindeers are cool. And I'm going to be making some... Oh, I love this. 
Christmas box. And actually what I'm going to do is make, eh, oh, beautiful. some recipe books. I'm going to bind them and add in some spots for some favorite family recipes for my mom. My brother's girlfriend loves to cook. So I think that'll be a good gift. Sorry, I had to put that aside. I've gone back to my small desk, so everything kind of shrunk on me. Let's see, I also, I got the Brad's for the Holly Jolly set. And it's funny because Two Piece didn't have the stamps, but they had the paper and the Brad's. My stamp store had the paper and the stamps, but I didn't find the Brad's. And I know they have a lot of bits and pieces, and I probably find them, but I had to get out of there before I blew every penny I had because they had Bow Bunny I just some really beautiful things so here's the chipboard and then I got some Prima poinsettias and honestly I just wasn't that thrilled with these I think these are a little too much glitter so what I'm going to do is take them apart and mix, mix and match some of these leaves and Glimmer Misties and see if I like them better because they were four dollars so I plan on doing something with them and then I also got this cool little book kit I thought it would make a great template if nothing else I'm just going to show you it is five envelopes in here really fun here's just a few of them and they are reversible if you want but what a great template so I thought I could make some really nice envelope books with that. Like I don't know how to make an envelope, but you know, just a little different template with the, the slot already in it. And it came with a few little doodads and some tags and some prompts, which I thought were really cool. Like family traditions and that's not them. There they are. Dear Santa, Top Ten Memories. You know, just really kind of fun. So I thought that would be fun to play around with. And then, of course, I mentioned I went to Michael's. And I went there for Christmas stuff. And I did. I found poinsettias that I like, like a thousand times better than the ones I bought. Of course, I used my coupon. They were less expensive. They have leaves in them. They have all the different size flowers. They have some mesh, meshy flowers. They even have this weird little ornament, mulberry paper. I think these are kind of more what I was looking for, but I've got a lot of books to make, so I know I'll go through both sets and still need more. So... If you've seen some good poinsettias out there, please let me know. And then here's some really pretty centers. And they have these in red and green also with little trees, but I'm more of a snowflake person. And I'm loving, sorry, I'm a little awkward here today. <laughs> I'm loving the Brads. They had a whole bunch of their clear stamps on sale. So they were what would be 40% off on clearance, so $5.99. And I have been eyeing these, the ones I got, for quite some time. I just think these are really kind of cool. Especially this one. This one really appeals to me. And that one, the little lamp one, table. The Oriental set. And then Hampton Arts. Kelly Panachi artsy edges. I could really see me using these. Sorry, my window's open. That's a helicopter going by there. So, I'll really be getting some use out of those. And then, I had picked these up and forgot to show you, and I know several have, have shown these, and I always meant to get them, and I used my 40% off coupon, and they're brides. They're in the bride section. And of all things, they're called Ivory Pearl Seals. But they're really pretty brads. And you could color those with your Copics. 
Like I'm working on my bird mini right now. Isn't that going to be a good eye? So. I thought I'd show you those in case you hadn't seen them. Something to keep your eyes open and be sure to check out the clear stamp set at Michael's. Because they had some really good deals. So that's everything I got. And thanks for watching and have a great day.